Welcome to um, How to Draw Inky Wonderlands, the beautiful new book by Joanna Besford. And today I'm going to use her tutorial to draw a, a butterfly. And I'm going to make it a little bit bigger than this one because I'm going to use this drawing for another video because I received a set of watercolor pencils that I would love to review uh, and I need a drawing for that so I thought well let's make a drawing by Joanna Besford's uh, tutorial series and then uh, try it, uh, transfer it to watercolor paper but first, first things first and we are going to start with um, exactly to do what she says here and number one is here it says draw a line and a circle so that's what we're going to do now here i have a pencil and the tracing paper that i received from joanna besford so let's give it a try I have a ruler here because it says I need to make a line so let's do that draw a line like that and then I should draw a circle and I believe this is going to be the head of the butterfly here is the next step two elongated teardrops so that should be something like this this is the first one and then the second one something something like this so now the next step is drawing a wing and I don't think I will be able to make the perfect wing in just one pencil stroke so this is where I think erasers are very handy. So I'm not afraid to make any mistake. It's all fine. You know and butterflies come in so many different forms and uh, there are there's such a variety so you cannot go wrong. Oh, I actually like this wing, I think. It's good. And here we have the lower wing. Different shape. Let's see if I can uh, I can do it. So it's something like this. Yeah, and that looks actually quite good. And now it's time. She says section section the wings into panels. This makes adding smaller details easier. And this is what she's doing. And when I talk about she, of course I am talking about Joanna Besford. And over here she makes the same, the same wing as the bigger one, only a little bit smaller. Now this looks all a little bit sketchy, but that's okay. And now she is... I'll show you. 
Here you can see sectioning the wings and then adding smaller details. So let's go for it. I'll just follow her tutorial, tutorial roughly, not completely different from what she's doing. I'll change this wing a little bit and add a smaller section in here. Uh, that's nice. But if I do that, I think I need to change this here too. Hmm. Well. Joanna is making some sort of heart shape here. I can't do that. I'll tell you why. I I always want to want it to look natural. And this doesn't look natural to me. I'm a bit strange when it comes to uh, things like that. It must make sense. If it doesn't, I can't, can't handle it. So I'll change this to and of course it has antennas like that. Now let the magic happen. I already folded the paper when you were not watching. I shouldn't have done that, I think, but well, this is the ink pen, the point one. And I'm going to trace what I just have drawn. This is not perfect, but that, that's okay. I think I can fix that uh, when I trace it onto the watercolor paper. Now, let the magic happen again. Now I folded the paper and now I s switch it and I can see here the wings of the butterfly shining through. I have to say I'm used to an even thinner type of tracing paper. By the way, this is a mistake, but I'm uh, I'm not panicking ab about it. 
it's okay. This is just a sketch to put on that watercolor paper. So, and if I would like to have this as a beautiful inky drawing, I would just ink it again, trace it again. But this is my first butterfly. So, A little mistake here and there is uh, no problem, I think. Well, let's see. And here we have a beautiful butterfly. Oh, I love this. If you want to see what's going to happen with the with this butterfly, you need to wait for the uh, the other video that will come very soon and then we'll see uh, how things will, will uh, progress. Well, Let's compare my butterfly with the one in Joanna's book. Here it is. I think it's not very, very bad. I'm happy with it. And uh, of course I need to do some erasing, but uh, I think I will leave that for another time. And um, I hope you want to see the follow up with the watercolor pencils. So um, keep uh, the YouTube channel uh, just uh, check it out regularly because another video is coming. So uh, see you in the next video. Bye bye.